Hey, how's it going? Drain is here. Welcome back to Diablo 2 Resurrected. Season 4 just started and I would like to continue with my series about the classes you can take in Diablo 2 Resurrected. So this time we will cover the Druid, so join me. So like before, the Druid has also three different skill trees he can take. We have summoning, shapeshifting and elemental. The Druid is a jack of all trades. I mentioned this before in our other video, but you have all kinds of things. So the summoning tree will give you, of course, summons, but it also can give you summons that can support your build. So for example, the Karen Vine, summons a vine that eats corpses and replenishes your life. So this can be very good. We have the shapeshifting skill tree also, and you have the solar creeper. Summons a vine that eats corpses and replenishes your mana. This can be very useful when you have an elemental build like me. You also have some summons here I mentioned before. I have never really played these summons but they got buffed. So you should definitely try them out. And we also have the Oak Sage, Heart of Wolverine and the Spirit of Barbs. The Oak Sage will just give you flat more life for you and your party. The Heart of the Wolverine will give you attack rating and more damage for you and your party and the spirit of barbs will reflect damage for you and your party so summoning got a buff it's okay especially the dire wolves can be good then we have shape shifting so shape shifting basically means you can shape into another form and when in this form you deal more damage get new skills etc so we have werewolf here if you transform into a werewolf you get more life more stamina, more attack rating and more attack speed. You also have the werebear on level 6. You get more life, more damage and more defense. And then you have skills that can be either used in werewolf form or werebear form. So for example we have maul here. When in werebear form, maul your enemies. We also have the fire class. This can be used by either form. And we have hunger, same for this. And for the werewolf form we have the skill tree here. So we got Feral Rage, Rabies and Fury. And the Weir Bear also has Shockwave. Shapeshifting can be fun. I personally don't really like it. This is because I mainly like the mage characters a bit more. And also when I am melee I just want to be a big damage dealer. So someone like the Barbarian or the Paladin for example. But definitely check it out. It can be very fun and also in Diablo 2 Resurrected they buffed this. A bit so shapeshifting is more viable now. The last tree we have elemental. This is my build for this character at the moment. So we have firestorm, molten builder, fissure, volcano and armageddon. And since they buffed the graphics a lot I really like the molten builder for example. It's a nice skill, looks very good and deals good damage. Fisher also a nice one to take and as you can see they all get buffs from each other so Volcano for example gets from Molten Builder and from Fisher so keep that in mind you also have the Arctic Blast, Cyclone Armor, Twister, Tornado and Hurricane the Twister and Tornado can be fun these are just tornadoes and ruins that will go through the level and will damage enemies and Hurricane is a storm around your character can also be very fun but the reason why I picked fire with this character the fire build is because of my items so if you go take a look at my items you can see I have the leaf staff and this gives plus 3 to fire skills so basically all my fire skills will be 3 levels higher then I have the stealth breastplate a rune ward again with the 25 faster rune walk 25 faster cast rate faster hit recovery and some regenerate mana, some stamina. So yeah, very good one. I wanted to show you guys real quick the opportunities you have when playing Druid. I really recommend playing Fire Druid since you can get the Leaf Rune Ward very soon in the game. But it's really up to you. Summoning can also be very fun. And as you can see I also took Poison Creeper and Oak Sage. Because I would really recommend just putting one point in each of them. These are the one point wonders for Druid. Plus 30% life is very good to have for only one point. And you get plus skills once you get items with plus skills. I really don't like shapeshifting. But it can be very good. And 
it's more what you prefer. I really prefer the mage builds a bit more. So this is why I picked the Firestorm. But you can also go for the Arctic Blast, Cyclone Armor, Twister, Tornado and Hurricane. Maybe I will switch it up later. But yeah, Brute is very fun. A good viable class. Make sure to bring enough mana potions if you pick the mage build like me. Because um, you don't have things like warmth. So you don't get mana back easily. It's also nice to start over right now because season 4 just begun. This was the quick overview of the Drood class. If you enjoyed this video make sure to leave a like and I see you in the next one. Bye.